the Passover, which is the first doctrine established by God through uh, the nation of Israel, the Passover is all about being delivered from wrath by the blood of the Lamb. And I'm telling you what, uh, you do not want to be deceived into thinking that the tribulation is God's wrath. There will be three and a half years of God's wrath, but we will not be here to endure that wrath because we are delivered from wrath. Thank God uh, we are not going to be here on planet Earth. Now, uh, you know, I just want to say this. I'm using the phrase, I'm using the terminology, the morning after, even though you could call it the day after or the week after or whatever. It really, it really doesn't matter exactly what terminology we're using right here. The point is when the rapture takes place, you don't want to be here. You do not want to be left behind. And one of the things that we will be talking about, and I will be reminding you, is Jesus is coming back, first of all, for those who love his appearing. If you don't want to see him, if you don't love his appearing, I don't know where that puts you when Jesus calls the church and says, hey, come come and meet me. I'm going to deliver you from this. If you don't want to leave, then I don't know that Jesus would force you to leave. I, I, I don't know. I mean, you got to sort that out for yourself. But I'm telling you this, I don't want to be somebody who who dreads or looks negatively upon Jesus coming to take his bride away. Also, not only, not only is he coming for those who love his appearing, he is coming for those who love the truth. <laughs>